This is Scott the Fix-It Guy. We have a Miele dishwasher that's not draining. Uh, here's a quick way to get it back working again. Just got to lift up on the spray arm to remove it. And turn the filter basket just a quarter turn and lift that out of the way. And then you have a non-return valve right here. Underneath is a drain impeller that may be stuck. So you just need something to pry off this little spring clip. You can use a knife, would work. Get that out of the way. And then you're just going to grab this and pull it up. Sometimes they're kind of hard to get up. But we're going to just pull it up to get it out. This is the non-return valve. It has a big ball bearing in there that has to sit down on a rubber seat. And sometimes there might be something stuck in there. So it's good to just check that out, make sure that ball bearing can drop down when it's in the vertical position. And then if we look down here, we see this little propeller looking thing. And this is called the impeller. And you should be able to move it pretty easily with your finger. So if you push it, it'll not move smoothly, but somewhat ratcheted because it's got a magnetic connection. But that's normal. And there may be a little piece of porcelain or a piece of broken glass that's gotten down in here and it's stopping the impeller from moving. If it can't move, it can't push the water out through here and you won't be able to have water drain. Having some water in the bottom of the sump here is normal. That's, that's a normal situation. But if the water is up as high as here, that means it's stuck. Okay, thanks for watching.